Hello my name is Krishna from Best Engineering Project and today in this video I am going to show you or I am going to talk to you how to interface 16 to 2 LCD module with your Arduino Uno board. The, in this video I am going to show you connection diagram, working principle and the pin connection or pin detail of this 16 to 2 alphanumeric LCD. The LCD module I am going to interface with this Arduino Uno board is JHD 16-2A LCD model as you can see here this model contains total number of 16 pin pin number 1 through pin number 16 and the all detail of pin is written in backside here as you can see as you can see that this LCD model contains total number of 16 pin that is 8 is for data pin D0 to D7 2 is for backlight that is LED plus and LED minus 1 is for ground that is VSS pin, 1 is for power supply pin that is VCC pin, 1 is for contrast that is VE pin, 1 is for set reset pin, 1 is for read and write pin and 1 is for enable pin. So as you can see that these all pin have their own function. Now let's talk about working mode of this 16 to 2 LCD module. In together there are two working mode as level in this LCD that is 4 bit mode and 8 bit mode in 4 bit mode we are only using for higher order data bit for communication that is D4 to D7 and in 8 bit mode you have to use all the digital data pin that is D0 to D8 pin now the interface between Arduino Uno board and the LCD is made much easier by the use of built-in Arduino library file that is liquidcrystal.h Now let's talk about component required for Arduino and LCD interface At first I'm going to talk about the hardware required One Arduino Uno board One 16 to 2 LCD Project board one current limiting resistor of about 1 kilo ohm but you can use any value ranging from 320 ohms to 1 kilo ohm one variable resistor of about 10 kilo ohm now let's talk the uh, work or the task done by this component this 10 kilo ohm resistor is used to this 10 kilo ohm variable resistor is used to adjust the contrast of LCD this current limiting 1 kilo ohm resistor is used to limit the current that is supplied to lead positive or lead negative of this LCD. And obviously for connection all these component together we need jumper. So the jumper must be as per your requirement. Now let's connect all these component together. As you can see this. Yeah, this pin is referred as pin 1 this is as 2 similarly up to pin number 16 now I am going to mount this LCD over this project board now let's see the circuit diagram of interfacing of LCD module and Arduino Uh, mirror this power supply that is plus 5 volt pin and ground pin to this project board this red wire is for plus 5 volt and this gray wire is for ground now I'm connecting the all ground pin together as you can see in circuit diagram pin number 1 is grounded Pin number 5 is also grounded. 2, 3, 4, 5. One terminal of variable resistor is also grounded. Whereas one terminal of variable resistor is given to plus 5 volt. Pin 
number 2 of LCD is given to plus 5 volt I am going to sort this 5 volt and input terminal of this resistor together pin number 3 of LCD that is BEE pin should be connected to the wiper of variable resistor pin number 4 is RS pin that is set reset pin that is connected to Arduino Uno board pin number 12 and pin number 5 is grounded as we had already done pin number 6 that is enable pin that must be connected to pin number 11 of Arduino Uno board and pin number 7 that is D0 pin number 8 pin number 9 and pin number 10 of LCD model that is D0 D1 D2 and D3 pin should be left open and pin number 11 that is D4 pin number 7 8 9 10 11 that is D4 is connected to pin number 7 similarly pin number 12 of LCD connected to pin number 6 pin number 13 of LCD connected to pin number 5 of Arduino board and digital pin D7 or pin number 14 of LCD is connected to D4 pin These all pin are interchangeable that is according to your code you can varize this pin connection in circuit diagram pin number 15 and 16 is not shown that is pin number 15 is for lead plus pin which must be fed through a current limiting resistor And pin number 16 is lead minus pin that is must be grounded. One terminal of this current limiting resistor must be connected to plus 5 volt power supply. As you can. Now the connection diagram of LCD interfacing with Arduino is completed. Now let's see the software part. Open your Arduino IDE. There you can see tab file. Click on this. Open the example. There you can see liquid crystal. And open the, any one example of this. At first I am going to open this hello world program. Uh, there you see the complete pin connection of LCD to Arduino and this also yeah, here you can change the value of pin or the pin connected to your Arduino Uno board according to your setting if you change this pin number here this RS is called to 12 that is RS pin of LCD is going to do pin number 12 of Arduino enable is called to 11 that is pin number 11 of LCD is connected to Arduino Uno board similarly uh, there D4, D5, D6 and D7 pin is con connected to D7, D6, D5 and D4 of Arduino Uno respectively after that in void se setup you must have to begin the LCD so this line LCD.begin is written here and in void loop you can write your masses according to your demand there I had write the best engineering project at first let verify it burning code at first select the port of your Arduino board 
that is go to tool there you can see in my setup there is com port for arduino or genuino board and set the board here as it is already arduino genuino you know board is selected and upload the program to your arduino you know board now our project is ready but no message is display over this lcd this might happen sometime due to the mismatch voltage at bee that is pin 3 of lcd for that you have to adjust this potentiometer so let's adjust adjust this as you move the wiper the display starts to come in this way you can also adjust the intensity of lcd now in next video i will tell you how to interface multiple display over common data line or how to multiplex this 16 to 2 lcd display in order to save the pin thank you for watching and please subscribe the best engineer project channel and click on the bell icon for more awesome project on a weekly basis